Assalamu alaikum dear students hope you are fine by the grace of almighty Allah welcome to NIVS home school I am Sabrina Hawk assistant teacher of science of National Idol English Version School Jeshi today I am going to take a science class for class 1 student on the based on chapter 8 the name of the chapter is animals in our life students let's start the class first topic is pet animals animals that we keep in our homes are called pet animals or pets we take care of them and love them they are like our friends dogs Cats, parrots, tortoises, fishes and rabbits are examples of pets. See there is a picture of our pets. Dogs, cats, parrots, tortoises, fish, rabbit. All are pet animals. Now we are going to the next point. The next point is farm animals. We keep some animals on the farm. They work in the field and help us in different ways. These animals are called farm animals. Hence, cows, goats, sheep and donkeys are examples of farm animals. Look students, these are the picture of farm animals. There is the hen, that is cow, that is goat and that is sheep and that is donkey. Then go to the next point, wild animals. Animals that live in the forest are called wild animals. We do not keep them in our homes. Lions, tigers, giraffes, zebras, elephants are examples of wild animals. Here are the picture of some wild animals. Look student, this is lion, this is a tiger, this is a giraffe, this is a zebra and this is, these are elephants. Now come to our next point, land animals. Animals live in different places. Some animals live on the land like lion, tiger, deer, giraffe, dogs, cats, cows, goats, sheep, hen, etc. These are the land animals picture. This is, this is lion, this is tiger, giraffe, dog, cat all live in land. That's why they are land animals. Now we are going to the next point that is water animals. Like the fish, many other animals live in water. They live in the lakes, river and seas. Like whale, octopus, starfish, jellyfish etc. Here the students, the, some pictures of water animals. That is whale, that is octopus, that one is starfish and that is jellyfish. All live in water, that's why they are called water animals. Now we will start the next point, animals that live on land and in water. There are some animals that live both on land and in water. Some of these animals are crab, frog, crocodile, hippopotamus, tortoise, etc. These are the animals who live on land and in water both the picture this is a picture of tortoise this is a picture of frog and this is a crocodile all live on land and in water both now we are going to our last point what do we get from animals we get many things from animals we get eggs from hens we get milk from goat and cows Milk is used to make butter and cheese. We get honey from bees. We get wool from sheep. We make warm clothes from wool. 
we you we also get meat from many animals here i gave some picture which one we get from animals this egg we get from hen and milk we get from goats and cows and from these meals <laughs> this is cheese and this is butter this, that all are makes from the milk that means cheese and butter also we get from animals students i gave three word meaning for you from the chapter let's start the word meaning our first word meaning is pet the meaning of the word is not wild or dangerous our second word meaning is wild the meaning of the word is living freely not tamed our third word meaning is filler a part of the body of an insect or other animal used to touch and feel students this is your homework also and this is your second homework for annual term examination dear student you have to submit your homework every sunday in school premises and you can collect the previous homework copy on same days this is our second class for annual term examination students do the homework carefully because you will get mark on the based on your homework on behalf of city diary and sba marks and practice at home learn all the topics abide by your parents stay safe stay home thank you allah hafiz